Protection and Reversal Magic by Jason Miller. Are you ready? I am a Jason Miller fan. Uh, I've enjoyed his books very much. He is very knowledgeable. He is very down to earth. Uh, especially considering the subjects that he tends to cover. He comes at magic from outside the box while honoring the traditions uh, that so many of us have become accustomed to. This book in particular, Protection and Reversal Magic, is just the sort of book that people are looking for, I think. If, if you think back to the early days, and, I, and I'm a little older than most, I suppose, um, I started reading books on the occult in the mid to late 70s. I started delving into Crowley in my uh, early teens. Books back then tended to just present it to you without going into any real depth. They left certain thing aspects out. They took for granted that you knew certain things, and I believe that they just came from a place of uh, you should be in an order, you should be going through initiatory steps, and they didn't approach things from for the, the solitary magician. And um, it, it would be later where, like, Scott Cunningham wrote some great books in that regard, but uh, where I where I come at with protection and reversal magic is that he kind of cuts through everything, presenting of spells of protection and exorcism rites, basically a way to create a defense against outside forces, um, sort of give you a defense mechanism against all these varied types of entities that you will be interacting with um, if you uh, choose to walk that path. It is an important book. Uh, it has been re-released by Wiser, and one of the, the best aspects of this, is especially if you had owned the previous version of this book, uh, Jason has gone in and written an update at the end of each chapter, uh, telling you how his thoughts have changed on various things, what things remain the same, of course, but there's been an, a lot of evolution since he wrote this book originally. And um, one of the things I, I thought was interesting and something that I had integrated into my own practice was uh, doing the lesser banishing ritual every day which never made sense to me as I was coming up in this. I, I felt it, it, it potentially overshielded you, and, th and that's one of the things he talks about in this. So sometimes you need to be more open to energies that could be interacting with you. This is a great book, highly recommended. It really, if, if you're into magic at all, if you are into uh, paranormal investigations, I would consider this probably the most important book that you would have in your library. Uh, you need to read this, reread it, take it to heart, and put some of it into practice. I don't agree with everything that you're going to find in here. I mean, when you're dealing with these subjects, you're never going to 100% agree with the person uh, who's putting this down, but the information is here. And you take what works for you, you integrate it into your personal philosophy and your personal magic system. Protection and Reversal Magic is published by Wiser Books. It will be available on the 1st of March of 2023. I would recommend that you pre-order it now. Get the book, read the book, enjoy the book, use the parts that work for you. That's all I have for you today. I am currently reading 
Marco Visconti's Alistair Crowley manual, and it is fantastic so far. I'll have a review of it very soon as uh, we approach spring. I wish you all good health and happy reading.